kind of want to start. I mean, how's the off season been? How's how's summer been? Uh, how are things going? Uh, it's been a little crazy. Most of the people haven't been showing up, so we're still trying to figure out what to do from there. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I know it's early, but with these first two practices, how's how's the team looking so far? Uh, I feel like we just need to be more be more disciplined. No, we need to know what we need to do. It's just like simple mistakes we keep messing up on. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, Talking about, I mean, getting back into the swing of things as far as football is concerned. Um, I asked the last two guys this: um, Is there, is there a certain part of, of summer practices, of, of summer workouts and stuff that kind of lets you know you're back in football season? Oh yeah, when we do our sprints and stuff and conditioning, and we know we're like getting our times and stuff right, we know we're ready. Yeah. For people who showed up. Yeah, yeah absolutely, man. Um, talking about kind of moving forward into into. Um, getting ready for the season and stuff like that. I think week zero or the first game of the year for you guys is against Patterson. Yeah. Um, what do you guys need to do between now and then to kind of be ready for the start of the season? So for Patterson, we basically need to know their front, their yeah. five front. And yeah, so because we're trying, to, we're switching like plays like every other play because we're not sure who we're supposed to go to. So that that's something we have to work on. Yeah, absolutely, man. Um, Personally, I mean, what do you what do you want to be able to do this year? What uh, what goals do you have? Uh, I just want to make it to playoffs. I mean, the teams we're playing, I feel like we can do it. Yeah. What's it going to take to be able to do that? I know that's kind of a broad question, yeah. but we just need to be more disciplined. We just we know what we need to do. It's just we need to do it right the first time. Yeah, absolutely. Do you have any uh, personal goals? Something you want to accomplish? Uh, um, get a couple sacks. You know, do the thing. Do, do my thing every play. Do the thing. I like yeah. it. <laughs> um, talking about talking about. I mean, you talked about it a little bit there, but um, the expectations for this team. I know last year you guys were kind of smack dab in the middle of of T Cal and stuff like that. Yeah. Um, what expectations do you think this team should have this season? I feel like with who we have, I feel like we can do pretty good. It's just we just need to work on everything. You know, some people when they don't show up. We just need to, for them, we have to compensate for us, and we have to work better for them. Yeah, absolutely, man. Yeah. Um, when it comes to league, I mean, you guys have that preseason schedule, um, playing a lot of SJA, SJ2A teams. Yeah. Um, when it comes to league, what kind of things do you guys have to um, have done, be ready for um, when, you, when you hit that first league game? I think Tracy it might be. Tracy, I'm, not, I'm not, pretty sure. It changed up. Yeah, 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 but what do you what do you guys have to have to be able to um, focus on going into the league? Uh, like I've said, we just need to focus on what we need to do. Yeah, and that's basically what we need to do. So if we don't know what we're doing, then we can't get it done. Right. Yeah. Yeah, makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> um, what's uh, what are you most looking forward to this year? What's what what are you most excited about? Uh, playing these new teams. So our schedule got switched up a little bit. And yeah. You can see new teams, yeah. Is there a certain game, certain team that you got uh, marked on your calendar? Uh, maybe Stag or Bear Creek. Yeah. yeah. Any any reason why or just, just want to play them? I just want to play them, yeah. There you go, man. Um, just the last couple things here for you. I mean, what uh, if there's going to be one thing, and I know you've, you've kind of talked about this subject just a little bit already, but if there's going to be one thing for you guys that kind of make or, makes or breaks the year, sways it one way or the other like one um most important key for this team what's it going to be it's going to be uh people who show up because if you don't show up you're going to miss half the game you're going to miss most of the game so we just need people to show up all the time yeah absolutely um just making sure i got everything for you uh oh uh <laughs> so we I, i've been throwing the guys on snapchat um and doing some fun questions, but uh, my phone's kind of dying right now, yeah. so we'll, we'll give you a few fun questions on this video. Uh, do you have any pregame rituals or uh, superstitions? Uh, I just listen to my playlist. I always have get me pumped up. Yeah. What's on the playlist? Uh, inappropriate songs. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll keep that one off the video then. Uh, do you have a Do you have an after game meal? Something you got to have after a game? Uh, no, not really. I just go home and take a fat nap and sleep. <laughs> There you go. Yeah. Uh, who's the funniest teammate out here? Uh, Dylan Prevatelli. <laughs> He's pretty, uh, pretty funny. Yeah. Funny looking. Funny looking. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 
who's the who's the hardest hitting guy out here? Uh, probably Luke Maw. Okay. I think so. He's a young guy. He knows what he's doing. Okay. Absolutely. Uh, if you had to describe this team in one word, what would it be? Uh, great. It'd be awesome. They uh, they know what they're doing sometimes, and when we get it, we can move forward.